Oh my god, it's slippery. It's hard to go. It's hard to walk on this slippery kelp when you got all this equipment. I've been spotted. Oh, I've been spotted. Take a look at that swim bait. I love this color. It's probably the best color. From uh, what people have told me, it's not the light color swim baits that work. It's the darker ones because when a dark thing like this swims in the water, the fish make out its silhouette and they make out this dark object floating around and they see that it's a fish. So that's why they hit the darker ones. But anyway, I've got this trout pole. If I hook up on a rockfish, this pole is gonna bend. <laughs> Let's get one, maybe. Well, nobody wants to hit my lure right now, so let's try some bait. <laughs> Ready. I was out fishing at the bay yesterday, and I was just thinking that I love ocean fishing so much more. Because when you fish in the bay, you're just waiting all day. But when you're doing this, when you're out in the ocean, when you got the tide pools around you, there's always fish here. So if you got the bait, you don't even have to wait more than a couple minutes and you'll be getting bites. I don't like to be waiting around all day. Although that big fish can make it be worth it. Oh, there's one. Oh yeah, I got one. I got one. I got one. Oh yeah. No. No. Oh, he took my bait. No, oh, he took my bait. Ah. All right, so as you can see, my hook right there is a size four hook. It's small. And what I'm being conscious of is when I bait it, I'm not just uh, baiting it and burying the hook like that. I'm trying to actually expose the tip of the hook a little bit so when a fish does nibble on it it'll get hook set oh wow there's the perch right there i see it i see it holy shoot did you see that did you see that perch he came up and got scared it was a perch he's swimming right here I changed the one size one hook to another size four. There it is, there he is. Oh, I got two of them. I got two of them on. Okay, I got two perch on there. <laughs> wow, two at a time. All right, now, how the hell am I gonna land this? I know I can't pull this up or my line's gonna break. All right, let's uh, bring them over here. I got two, I got two on. See those? Or right, actually, I think I could. They're little guys. Ooh, look at that pole bed, baby. Oh, yeah. Two little perch, two perch. I know, I know it's just perch. Everybody wants rockfish, but I'm just here for fun. I just like catching fish. Woo! <laughs> so when you're handling a perch, as you can see these spines, they've got these spikes here. They're very sharp. So what you wanna do is grab them and put the spines down. Go with the flow of the spine and grab them like that. Let's pop that hook out. Let's give him a clean release. Swim away, my friend. All right, while I use my trout pole, we're gonna see if Johnny can catch his first fish. Yep, there's a bite. Oh, uh, come on, bite it harder. Oh, I got one. I got one, I got one. <laughs> That's the same one you caught, dude. Nah. <laughs> Another perch, three perch. Nah, he'll be fine. Dude, first fish, man. Oh, Hell yeah. Shit, uh, <laughs> not Take a picture, yeah, dude. <laughs> Thank you. 
Yeah, look at this fish hanging out of his oh mouth right there. Oh my god. He's got it. It's coming out. Holy my god, look at that. He's got a black rockfish in him. Oh, he's half digested. It. He's got a hook in his fish mouth. There's a line in there, too. Ooh, Careful for your teeth. Wow, look at that. Is that a kelp greenling? It is, dude. Did they, did 